Funky Bow is an amazing venture my dad and I took uh, starting three years ago. It's a father and son coming back together after not talking for seven years and just deciding to make beer because beer brings people together. And we have an awesome following. Brower nights are awesome. Our beer has just become a uh, top selling beer. Funky Bow Beer Company is a producer of craft beer that uh, was molded after beer that we like, which was traditional American ales with a West Coast influence. If you never tried Funky Bow beer, you have to try our Sofoken IPA, our uh, G-String Pale Ale, they're bright, they're citrusy, not to mention our coffee porter. Lots of coffee, it's got nice chocolate notes to it. Our beer is set apart by other beers, number one, because of the talent of our brewers, and number two, the quality of our water, which no one in the state has the water that we have. All the water we use here at Funky Bow is natural spring water from the ground, and uh, it just lends a nice flavor and character to the beer. Typically, we have eight brews on tap at the brewery here, and we brew four to five days a week. Basically, we're a production brewery for three days a week on the pale ale and the IPA. And then that other day of the week, we try to fit in our specialty beers, the Panama Red, the Midnight Special Coffee Porter, and the single hop series that we do, the Galaxy, the Citra. The brewing process, a brewing day typically starts fairly early. There's a lot of setup involved, a lot of cleaning. The actual brewing process is a small part of the day. Uh, that takes generally about three hours in a 14 hour day. So the morning time we come in, we mill in, and then we mash our grains, and we get the day ready to roll. Brewing is pretty much from eight to six, eight to seven, typical day. Uh, we clean tanks, we transfer beer, we put stuff in the beer or take stuff out of the beer. You know, it's, it's really just every day is structured differently, just to get to the end of the week and, and brew our 60 barrels. We put Funky Bow in cans because, first of all, they're light blocks, so you can't get light through the, the can, which can harm beer. The shelf life of the beer is more stable in a can, and the cans don't break. Also, uh, the canning process is extremely well done here, so there's little, little oxygen in there. Funky Bow is definitely unique in a lot of ways. Uh, I'd say the thing that sets us apart from everybody else is the experience when you come up here. We're up in the hills of Lyman. We've got a greenhouse as our tap room. You can find Funky Bow in Maine, New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, and Massachusetts. If you haven't had Funky Bow, definitely go out and buy some, and I uh, hope you enjoy our beer.